welcome everybody. Uh, my name is Harish Subramanian. I'm a director here at uh, Great Lakes. So what is this postgraduate program in cloud computing? It's a six month executive program for working professionals. It's designed specifically for people who want to, you know, get on the architect path. Obviously, we're going to cover, you know, a lot of other areas, including DevOps, uh, you know, some of the system elements as well. Um, you'll be thinking about adoption and migration issues that are pertinent to architects and so on. But the idea is to think like an architect, think about about you know design holistically, um, designing solutions holistically, and then implementing them. Right? It's online uh, with, uh, but it's interactive online, which means that you will have live sessions, uh, live virtual sessions, and and tons and tons of hands-on work as uh, as Sohail was just talking about. Um, and it's taught and endorsed by industry leaders. Sohail himself is one of them, but there are a number of others who will be teaching you at various points. And as Sohail said, um, yes, while AWS is going to be um, you know, a significant portion of the uh, of the program. We will have um, you know uh, we will have an Azure expert come and give you an alternative view from the public cloud perspective. But we'll also talk to you about the private cloud perspective, right? For uh, you know, a vast number of your organizations are going to uh, be building private clouds themselves and or hybrid clouds, uh, and so that's an important thing as well. And uh, you know, we try to make this program. Um, globally relevant, so you do get a, a dual international certification from Milner Institute of Technology as well as Great Lakes. Um, one of you had a question very specifically about AWS certification. Um, we do, a, we, we look, there's a lot of um, education and learning here that will help you uh, succeed in pretty much, um, uh, well, I, I wouldn't guarantee it, but, but you're fairly, you can be fairly confident that you'll get through the solution architect uh, um, certification or you will also be going through a fair bit of content towards the DevOps certifications and so on. But a certificate from Great Learning um, and Illinois Institute of Technology is more like an educational certification which basically talks about, uh, which, which gives you the comfort that you've completed a holistic program and it's not an industry certification the way an AWS or an Azure certified or an IBM certified cloud uh, professional is. So quickly what we learn in the program? Largely four buckets. Um, you know, obviously you will be learning a lot of the cloud foundations, right? What are the various service models? What are the various deployment models, virtualization containers, cloud architecture, adoption and migration issues? What is the landscape of the offerings, cloud economics and so on and so forth? Um, and then you will be learning this, all of this in the context largely of AWS. So as you can see, a, a, a host of uh, tools there for on around network storage, compute and database um, uh, services. You'll be learning a variety of practical, uh, uh, you know, um, uh, core services. I, I would say, uh, like load balancing, auto scaling, and a number of uh, other ways of building highly scalable fault tolerant solutions. But you will also get an alternate view of public cloud, as I was saying, through Microsoft Azure as a platform as a service, and you will get a private cloud. Um, uh, perspective um, with OpenStack so that you're able to adapt. Right? Because the key, as I said earlier, is versatility. Right? A lot of cloud professionals these days have to be versatile. You don't know when you're walking into either your company or other companies which of the cloud platforms you're going to use, whether it's public or private. If, if it's public, which environment are you going to use? Are you going to have to integrate with other services? How much do you need to know? Um, which is all well and good if you are going to be just an administrator or if you're just going to um, you know, work on one narrow band, but if you want to think like an architect and, and, and get on that track, you have to understand all the moving parts a lot more holistically. What all of this means is that a vast majority of what you're going to be learning is is, is a solution approach. Um, you know, so you will have a number of use cases, scenarios uh, that you will walk through, and all of these different scenarios, whether it's, um, you know, hosting a website, hosting uh, different applications like um, you know, CRM tools, uh, uh, you know, looking at uh, managing multiple cloud platforms, um, you know, thinking about content and content management through, you know, through the, the way Netflix and YouTube has to worry about it. All of these are going to provide different challenges and different kind of perspectives. And, you know, going through a number of these, lots of practice over and over and over again is the only way you, you start to think more holistically about all the various challenges and problems. So that's an emphasis. Um, and then you're obviously going to have, you know, your own comprehensive capstone project to build, uh, which will, which will, you know, basically be um, 
you know you will have a mentor supporting you but uh, but the idea there is that you build something that is pertinent to your career um, and uh, and is a lot more uh, you know self driven uh, and and that will complement all of the hands on scenarios very very well right uh, a number of faculty and industry experts and advisors are all people as you can see all you know there are people from you know amazon um uh, such as sohail and john kiram who are, who's ex amazon um anil uh, has worked at, on on the microsoft stack and, and continues to be a cloud solution architect there um you know we have folks who lead cloud uh, in solutions and uh, deployment at ibm uh, people who come in from more of the consumer perspective right so from infosys and the like who are who are thinking about either as what does it mean for them to be building like, you know making these choices as architects either for themselves internally or on behalf of others so this is just an indicative list there are a number of industry experts but as you can see this is very heavily focused on getting you a practical industry expert perspective uh, with a goal that you will then go on and you know and actually use all of this information in architecting and designing solutions I can't emphasize this enough it's all about build 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 so lots of hands on and solution oriented uh, approach so you'll have case studies you will have um you know practical assignments that you'll have to do uh, throughout this program you have a learning management system with which to engage with us the program team um as well as with each other uh, peer learning is an important part of what we do um and and obviously industry led modules and capstone sessions Right. um in terms of career success yeah in addition to all of this we do um you know all also guide you in terms of in, uh, a career development workshop uh, making lateral opportunities available to you through the uh, through olympus our, our online man learning management system um you know a number of people especially mid career succeed by working with each other and for each other uh, with their peers uh, as well as connecting with the industry guests and and that's an essential part of uh, you know finding your career success as well and uh, if you have uh, uh, any questions i am just going to leave this uh contact information up please feel free to reach out to our admissions office um and yeah and and have a wonderful day and i hope to interact with a number of you uh, through the program over the coming uh weeks and months thank you